Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an intro to another product and I was not going to do this but then I was watching Jessica's uh, video this morning and I was like damn I need to do that. <laughs> I already have two other products going so uh, I've mostly picked like skincare items because in those two I only have makeup so I will have them listed in the description box if you're more into makeup products and I will have that listed uh, so you can check that out but yeah this is the drop 10 before summer product and this was started by uh, Jessica from Beauty and Baseball or maybe Jessica Lee yes, she said that she was going to change her name I don't know if she has but uh, she was talking about doing it on Instagram at least and then also Amanda D or Makeup Junkie 80 and also Jana from Product Pan Product underscore Pan one, I believe. I will have them listed in the description box, as uh, along with everyone else doing this collab. And as I said, this is called Drop Ten Before Summer. Summer, so you're supposed to uh, use up ten products, but also lose ten pounds. And uh, when I was thinking about the products, I was projects I was going to do this year. Uh, I was not really going to do it, but then I've sort of gained ten pounds. So. I suppose I need to just to lose those again before summer. So yeah, let's just get into my products. They are supposed all supposed to be like summer themed and mine are sort of, kind of loosely. Um, I just wanted to make sure I could use some of them up. So yeah, first product is this lip balm by Shepstick. Is this is in the lot of sort of flavor or scent classic strawberry and strawberries are very like a summer fruit for me when I was uh, younger I used to go like where you could pick uh, by yourself and then you just paid by the weight and uh, yeah so it's very like nostalgic summer for me so that's why I picked this one and then I also have this one which is the L'Oreal Pure Clay uh, Purify Mask and this is sort of like a summery mint green <laughs> So that's why I picked this one. Uh, as you can see I have used it a bit like there is I don't know if you can tell but there is like a dent in it but I would really like to use this up before uh, summer so it starts today which is the 21st of March and then it's going to end the 21st of June because that's the first day of summer I believe. But then I also have this coconut passion vanilla and coconut like uh, Victoria's Secret body spray fragrance mist <laughs> but yeah this is like yellow and flowers and everything and it's very summery and it has like a mm, it smells really good it's like it's really it's a lot of vanilla it says coconut passion like coconut and vanilla but it's a lot of vanilla so yeah i think i will really enjoy uh, wearing this scent uh, until summer because it's not like a super summery scent where it's like fruity and very like clean it's more of it's more heavy than that so yeah but I have marked it so we will see how much I can use that before next time and this is sort of a gimme product I didn't know I had this little amount left when I chose this product but this has like flowers on it and it smells really like nice and fresh which reminds me in summer and like my favorite time to use this is like put them in the on, in the fridge and then like spray them all over my face because I'm so bad at using setting sprays because because I always feel like they make me more oily which I don't think they do but yeah it's just a feeling I have so I want to try and use this up and I don't think that will be a problem and then I have also picked this foundation uh, because this is uh, and this is MAC uh, Studio Fix Fluid in the shade NC15 so as you can see it's a tiny bit too dark but it's more my summer shade <laughs> and I would also like to use this up before summer so you can see I don't have too much left but I would like to use this up before summer because this is a really like matte formula and I think a dewy finish looks better in the summer so even though I'm super oily so I wear my all year round but I don't like this one because it's really heavy so I like to finish this before summer and then we have four products left the first one is this Tata Harper Next Generation Beauty Face uh, Regenerating Cleanser which is a very like summery green grass green uh, bottle so 
I would like to try and use this up. This is completely full, uh, but I think that if I use it like every every day, every night and maybe, or I, I tend to use cleansers more in the morning and then I use like those uh, Olay daily facial cloths, you know, those, you sort of uh, wet them and then you rub them all over your skin. I, I tend to use those in the evening and then I will be using this every morning uh, as a cleanser. And then I also chose this Yves Rocher uh, nail polish in Citroen because it's a very like yellow and sunny and yeah summer color. So I would like to use this up. I haven't marked it because I sort of shook it before I started like filming. But yeah, I'm going to try and use this up during this product. And then I also have this Ole Henriksen. Uh, I know everyone says it differently, but like it's, it, I think it's a Danish name, and that's absolutely how I would say a Danish name. So I know Ole Henriksen. <laughs> That's what I'm going to say. So this is the True Serum. It's uh, yeah, with like True C complex. I think it's sort of like vitamins, vitamin C in it. But I haven't used this. But it's just a small size. I got it in a glass box. But it's very like orange and bright and yeah, it's a really tiny bottle. But I think I will be able to use this up, like the serum I'm using right now will be done in like a few days so then I will start focusing on this one and whoops, I'm really excited, I haven't tried anything from Ole Henriksen before. Okay, so then we only have one product left and I'm gonna not like myself for this <laughs> but I'm going to try and focus on this blush. So this is the Makeup Revolution uh, Ultra Blush Palette in Hot Spice and I would like to try and hit pan on this brush, maybe. Uh, I'm not currently using any blush in a product, a project and I thought I might as well try this one. I'm super bad at using like my face palettes. I'm pretty good at rotating through like my single of like blushes and highlighters and bronzer and everything but I'm not too good with using my face palette so I would like to make a dent in this one. Okay so those were all the products I'm hoping to drop before summer and then I'm also going to include a photo right here of my weight this morning and this is going to be in kilos because that's what we use like that's the metric system or weight system <laughs> we use here in Sweden but I'm also going to include like a number besides that which is my current weight and I would like to drop 10 pounds before the end of this product and my goal is sort of or like my goal until next time will be to drop maybe four pounds I think that's sort of reasonable before when because last summer I was the weight I am now and then I managed to drop um, like I think I dropped 12 pounds during the summer and then I noticed that like four pounds a month is pretty reasonable for me so that's what I'm going to try and do so next update I hope this number is four pounds uh, smaller than it is now so yeah uh, give this a thumbs up if you like this video and uh, subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in my next one bye